An explosion of locally transmitted local cases was reported on Sunday. The CECC reported a staggering 83 local cases, the highest daily count so far this year. Here's the breakdown in each municipality. 19 in Jilong, 6 in New Taipei, 52 in Xinju, 2 in Kaohsiung and 4 in Taidong. There were an additional 120 imported cases. The most prominent 52 cases in Xinju mostly originate from a dorm for migrant workers who work in the Datan power plant in nearby Taoyuan. But what really worries CECC Commander Chen Shizhong are three virus transmission chains that were found in a karaoke parlor in Jilong, a hikers club in New Taipei, and a family in Taidong. All are believed to be spreading. This is what Chen had to say. Some of these places where people come and go are a little shady. They are invariably related to specific entertainment venues, especially those that provide escort services. So starting now, we are requiring the whole country, when entering these specific entertainment venues, to provide proof of having received at least three doses of vaccine. Those who have not been vaccinated with a booster shot are not allowed to enter. And you have to provide personal details before entry. Of course, those with respiratory symptoms and fever are not allowed to enter. In the future, when entering karaoke parlors, dance halls, nightclubs and other entertainment venues, whether you're an escort or a customer, a certificate showing you've had three COVID shots must be provided. All workers at these venues should be fully vaccinated, with the second dose received at least 14 days ago. Those that have received the second dose more than three months ago need to get a third shot. Otherwise, they're barred from providing any services. The CECC is endeavoring to cut all possible channels that allow the virus to spread.